teenage boy and his twin brother go to the cardiac care unit of the hospital and see their father laying in the bed. All types of machines are attached. Strange noises are going off in the hospital room. Nurses are entering and exiting as they check on their father and the other patients. They weren't aware, but earlier that day their father had a heart attack and was rushed to the emergency room for life-saving surgery. Through the months and the weeks that followed the, the surgery, they learned that healthy eating habits and the way to prepare food is very important in having a healthy and a happy lifestyle. That teenage boy was me. And very a few months prior to that, a mentor had a heart attack. He lived as well, but it was a very traumatic experience for the family. And he was a youth pastor. It was also very traumatic for the church as well. Poor choices in eating habits and the way that foods are prepared can have many health issues and cause serious problems later on in life. The Center for Disease Control say that 90% of Americans have too much sodium in their diet. Too much sodium increases the risk for high blood pressure. And high blood pressure can cause heart disease, strokes, and also other vascular problems. Over 800,000 people a year die from heart disease, strokes, and vascular problems. It's a very serious problem and some, something that we need to consider when we're making our, our eating choices. Another issue to discuss is the, the way the foods are prepared. When you cook with certain oils, it's important to remember that you don't overheat the oils because they have a smoking point. Also, in cooking foods such as poultry, when you prepare poultry, if, if you don't reach the desired temperature of the in, internal temperature of the meat, then it also can spread foodborne illnesses. It's not very difficult to do this as with a little bit of education and a little bit of time and a little bit of forethought. You can plan your meals out. You can have healthy meals, meals that are enjoyable for your family and that are easy to prepare. The Cleveland Clinic they recommend using olive oil. Olive oil is one of the best oils to use. It's, it's not high on saturated fats or trans fats, which you would like to try to avoid. The more refined the oil, as I mentioned earlier concerning the smoke point, the more refined the oil, the higher the smoke point is. Uh, the smoke point, once it reaches a certain level, it actually releases, if you reach that smoke temperature, it releases toxic fumes, and it also will release free radicals, which are harmful to your body. In your healthy choose food choices that you make, the U.S. Department of Human and Health Services on their website, they say a healthy diet can keep your body strong and active. And by making smart food choices, can help protect, to protect you from heart disease, bone loss, type 2 diabetes, high blood pressure and some cancers. These choices that you can make that are easy to do are something that will help you be healthier. This health that you can have and this satisfaction that you can have from being healthy will help you to be able to spend more time with your family, to go on the outings that you, that you need to. Sometimes you may not be able to, to perform that activity that is desired. Maybe your family likes to go to Stone Mountain on an outing or do something like that. You know, in the past, before making the smart choices and making the, the good decision, you're not able to, to climb that mountain, to walk all the way up the hill. But it's a goal that you can set, something that through healthy eating choices and other healthy lifestyle that you can, you can see come to fruition. Also, healthy eating choices, though it may be more expensive while preparing the food, they can also help in saving you money in the long run by saving in medical bills, 
They can save in, in many other ways. Uh, preparing the food yourself can stop you from, from having to pay that expensive restaurant food. Restaurant foods and foods that are already processed are, are known to be the highest in sodium content, which as we learned earlier, are harmful to your health. This longer life and the ability to have the long life and to be satisfied while you're doing that is, is something to strive for, something that is easy, something that, that can be attained by all. I urge you to strive to cook better, to pick meals that are, that are healthy for you and for your family so that you can have a good time, so that you can, you can enjoy life. You can enjoy the food. You can make good, healthy food that is enjoyable to eat, but also that is good for your body, that will help you live longer, and that will help you strive to do what you should do. Remember, healthy eating choices is important for you and for your family and, and, and can increase your overall enjoyment in life. 